Hello and welcome to Midday Update. Coming up are the top stories for the day. Afghanistan. Three people killed, six injured in an explosion in Qunar. As many as three people have been killed and six others have been injured after an explosion in Afghanistan's Qunar province, Afghanistan-based sources reported citing local authorities. According to officials, the incident took place when the explosion occurred in the house of a person named Nurgul. Ron DeSantis drops out of White House race and endorses Donald Trump despite disagreements. In a major development ahead of the U.S. presidential polls, Florida Governor and GOP leader Ron DeSantis dropped out of the presidential race and endorsed rival and former President Donald Trump, sources reported. In a video message on social media platform X, DeSantis said that he is ending his White House bid after an underwhelming performance in Iowa, adding that there was no clear path to presidential success for his campaign. Thailand told Oman to a goalless draw. Oman's hopes of advancing to the knockout stage of AFC Asian Cup Qatar 2023 were dented when they were held to a goalless draw by Thailand in a Group F match on Sunday. The 0 for 0 draw, however, boosted Thailand's hopes of advancing to the knockout stage as they collected one point to take their tally to four, while the Red Warriors earned their first point from two games. Amani Drone Company receives global recognitions for innovative technical solutions. Najma Marsha's youth company has won a number of awards for its contributions in providing innovative technical solutions. Said Ben Abdul Kafur Balushi, CEO of the company, said that Najma Marsha's focuses on research and development to provide innovative technical solutions that contribute to technological progress in the Sultan of Oman and make it a global technology center. The Omani Society for Human Resource Management Conference spotlight on the latest trends in human resources. The Omani Society for Human Resource Management, in collaboration with the Ministry of Labor, is set to host the seventh edition of its annual conference from February 12 to February 14, 2024, at the Oman Convention and Exhibition Center. The themes for this edition will delve into leading the artificial intelligence revolution, navigating its ethics, and exploring its impact on the future of jobs. Those were the top stories for the day. For more updates, stay tuned and keep watching TTV.